Hello everyone. I like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Wednesday, 15th of March 2023. These few trades were shared by MG, who is trading the Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD using a forex broker and a macro of one hour. We see the price is kind of sideways leaning down and this level got rejected so after breakout up uptrend channel is formed and using a five minute trading chart you can see several pullback were taken using this channel and the pullback when it got completed and the price is in right area based on algo one to five he entered one position here and close it with exit strategy number one with profit here and also the next pullback when the buyers came back again he entered two positions here and closed and managed them both with profit and these are the result of his trades for the day on the forex account and thanks mg for sharing your trades with us the next few trades were shared by yan or global instructor who's trading nasdaq in form of futures and as you see the macro of hourly and 10 minute charts is an uptrend but now there's a pullback here and while the price was going up he took long position on this uptrend channel using 10 second trading charts against the two minute trading chart and when the price got rejected and the pullback started to happen he traded the reversal and take short positions on this downtrend channel and we can see the result of the day for all his trades was profit factor of 1.96 with the average win rate of 61 percent an average win to loss ratio of 1.24 and the largest winning trade was 205 dollar and the largest losing trade was 109 dollar so thank you yan for sharing your trades with us the next few trades are those i have taken at the beginning of new york market session and the video with explanation was shared yesterday with the students and i'm gonna replay the video here for you hello everyone i'd like to share with you a few trades that i have taken at the beginning of New York market session on Wednesday 15th of March 2023 these trades were taken on micro and also e-mini futures of Nasdaq and Russell if we look at the macro chart in one hour we can see that the price uh, during the global session uh, it went up and during the London session several economic news happened before the market so it went down again and retested uh, in nasdaq the level of uh, 12,000, which is the point of control in the last few days and this level hold and uh, the buyers came back and got rejected the price at this level so if we look at the five minute macro we can see here more clearly at 930 here this level was tested and then the buyers came back and it was going up so when the market opened it went up all the way so therefore this was opportunity to take the pullbacks and take long positions around this candle that opened at 9 30 and this candle and this candle so it was very choppy you can see large shadows and we don't recommend under high volatility now it's traders to trade this market and uh, so i took long positions here again long positions here which are these candles and finished around 10 o'clock also took long position that, that became runner on Russell and close it around 10 o'clock. If we look at the result that was copied by Replicant to Copy Trader to multiple Apex Trading Fund account, we can see that the total uh, result of profit factor from all these trades was 1.86, and uh, we can see that we reached 61% win rate from the long side. It was very choppy, so I took mostly set up c and b and therefore average win to loss ratio has to be higher to become profitable which was around two we can see that the largest winning trade 
was 450 and the largest losing trade was 274. So hope these trades that were taken by the PAT system for fast scalping is useful for you. And let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.